Have you ever pictured an ancient Celt? What comes to mind? Probably someone with fiery red hair, pale skin, and maybe some blue war paint, right? That's the classic image we see in movies and books. But what if I told you that for a huge chunk of history, the people living in the British Isles looked very different? Get ready, because we're about to bust a major myth. Recent scientific research, especially from the Neolithic and Early Bronze Age, is completely changing our understanding of ancient Britons. By analyzing ancient DNA, scientists have made a startling discovery. It turns out that a massive majority of the population back then, we're talking up to 85%, had dark to very dark skin. That's right, dark skin. They also likely had dark, curly hair and blue eyes, a combination that's quite rare today. So, where did the fair-skinned, red-headed image come from? Well, that genetic profile became more common much, much later, with subsequent waves of migration from continental Europe. These new groups, like the Beaker people, brought different genes that gradually mixed with the existing population. Over thousands of years, the genetic landscape shifted. Lighter skin became more advantageous in Northern Europe because it helps the body produce vitamin D in a region with less sunlight. It's a fascinating example of how populations change and adapt over millennia. The story of the early inhabitants of Britain is far more complex and diverse than the simple stereotypes we've been taught. The iconic Celtic look is just one small, relatively recent chapter in a very long book. So next time you think of ancient Britain, remember the dark-skinned, blue-eyed people who first called those Greenlands home. It really makes you rethink everything you thought you knew about history, doesn't it? Thanks for watching. If you found this as mind-blowing as I did, hit that like button and subscribe for more historical deep dives. See you in the next video.